The summer washout continues with warnings of road closures and fly debris. A storm Anthony expected to bring more heavy rain across the UK. So Storm Anthony will bring us some very strong winds with some gales this morning, particularly towards southwestern areas. Some heavy rain for many of us as well, but that's all going to ease off later this afternoon. Good morning. It's Saturday the 5th of August. The Met Office is warning of potential road closures, power cuts and flying debris as Storm Anthony batters Wales and southwest England. Amber alerts are in place for high winds and Northern Ireland is being deluged by heavy rain. Let's get more from our reporter Thomas Morgan. It's not quite been the great British summer we'd all hoped for. At a time when we should all be outside, rain's disrupted music and sporting events up and down the country. This was Chester last month. Just some of the rotten weather that's made this July one of the wettest on record. And unfortunately, it doesn't look like things are due to get any better for some of the country this weekend. There are a few areas of concern. First of all, Northern Ireland, where we're going to get some heavy persistent rain. 20 to 40 millimetres, maybe more than that over the hills, for example, the Morns, could be enough to bring us some flooding problems. And then, a storm answerly moves into England and Wales. Across southwest England and Wales, we get a swathe of very strong winds. Gusts of 50 to 65 miles an hour could bring down one or two trees. The Met Office began naming storms around eight years ago. And Storm Anthony is only the third time they've named a weather event in August. With some predicting this could be the worst weekend of summer on the roads. We're expecting uh, today to be a very challenging day on the roads. Around four million people are expected to travel. Lots of people will be heading uh, away on holiday and lots of people will be heading back. So we're urging people to take extra care. The roads are going to be very wet and the wind is going to be a big problem. So the message is to slow down, leave extra space behind the vehicle in front and be particularly careful uh, of the wind. Keep two hands on the wheel uh, and make sure you remain in control all of the time. With a month of school holidays to go, most will be hoping the sun pitches up soon to rescue what's been a dire summer so far. Thomas Morgan, BBC News.